Howdy ho y'all and welcome back. How's it going, little chunk? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you go right on up and ah, let's see what we got on good old camera three. Oh, well, hello there. <laughs> All right, I found your damn box. My wunderkind returns. In my entire court, I knew there was only one who could have succeeded in this task. Finally, the Ankaran sarcophagus is ours. Come. I've granted Beckett's request to study and document all the markings of the sarcophagus. You've met Beckett, haven't you? Let's go take a look inside and see what the commotion around the city has really been all about. Hmm. Know what? <laughs> Prince LeCloy and Ming Xiao sitting in a tree. P-L-O-T-T-I-H. <laughs> Fucking love Malkavians. What? Preposterous. No kindred would trust them, nor would they trust us. Did Jack tell you that? Because it sounds like you've been taken for a fool. And I've been taken for a ride. They've been trying to take over L.A. for years. It's a ruse, a falsehood, spread to undermine my rule and turn kindred against each other, thin our ranks. They are duplicitous, evil creatures. Did they not try to kill you? Hmm. Lots of people have. Insurance. They lied to you in case you lived through the encounter. They hoped to create dissension in the ranks, rumors. It's a trick older than you or I. Hmm. Paranoia again. Let's open the box. What have you assessed so far? Unfortunately for the Heralds of Doom, it appears we won't be opening Pandora's box. The markings, as far as I can tell, are of Assyrian origin. An extraordinary piece, but nothing earth-shattering. I see. Then there is no good reason why we shouldn't open it. <clears throat> oh, budge. Beckett, do you see any mechanism for the lid? I haven't as yet had a chance to pour over it with my fine-tooth comb. I think I have one in my bag. <clears throat> why won't it... Uh, why won't it open, Beckett? And you, I thought you said it looked as if it had been opened on the Dane. I want it open! You, you and Beckett, figure out a way to open it. I need to know what's inside. I have other matters to attend to. Come get me when a solution has been found. I mean, I think it's pretty obvious how you ah, open the it. the depths to which I'll sink to prove others wrong. The young ones get so temperamental. Fortunately for Sebastian, is it? I'd already made up my mind to open the sarcophagus. If only to show the city that Gehenna, contrary to popular belief, has not begun. Mmm. What's in the box? Put your ear to it. I'll shake it. And you tell me what you think's inside. A better idea? Yes, quite astute. Fortunately for us, I know of someone who has distinguished himself in this field. Uh, the guy from the historical network with the pith head. He makes learning fun. Cemetery uh, run no. off. Can His name is Dr. Ernest Johansson, a professor of archaeology from Norway. He was the one responsible for finding the sarcophagus, and as far as I know, the only authority on its origin and design. Hmm. Was he in the bathroom? You can always find mortals in there. Until yesterday, he could have been found in his suite at the Empire Hotel downtown. But when I stopped by earlier this evening, all I found was spilt coffee on a morning paper. It appears he's been abducted. Damn aliens. That's dirty, right? I detected the scent of myrrh incense, which is usually burned in monasteries. Also, I found beach sand in part of a muddy footprint. Putting two and two together, I located a monastery near a beach in Malibu, where I believe hunters are holding Johansson captive. 
Neat. I would have taken the opportunity to see the mattress, uh, see if the mattress can fly. Actually, there were two hunters on the roof of the building opposite the hotel who were positively delighted to tell me everything they knew, provided I stopped dangling them headfirst over the side. What hunters? Where? Who? Why? Which? The hunters abducted Dr. Johansson for his own protection, or at least that's how they've justified it. He's being held by the Society of Leopold and used, quite ingeniously, as bait for Prince LaCroix's minions. Leopold is a good name for a turtle. Sebastian mentioned you ran into one of the hunters from the Society of Leopold some time ago. They're so secret a church organization, I don't even think they know if they exist. But essentially, they're murderers for Christ or some such deity. Hmm. All right, I'm a fish. Where's the hook? You'll have to go to the monastery and find a way into the tunnels beneath where the hunters are holding Johansson. I'm afraid I can't accompany you, but then it's best you go alone. Too many of us might set them off, like fundamentalists on contrary opinion. Hmm. Can I borrow your airship? I wouldn't recommend walking. Certainly, Sebastian's already provided cab fare. I'm sure he always spares no expense when archaeology is at stake. Hmm. Why am I still here? I should be gone. Remember, Dr. Johansson is an innocent. He has no idea we actually exist. Try not to put the idea in his head. No guarantees. What idea? Hey, big guy. Did you find a way to open the sarcophagus? No. I can't have my protege looking plebeian, can I? You'll find I can be very generous towards those who serve me well. Point made. <laughs> Did you find a way to open the sarcophagus? Which is? Did you find a way? Come back when you have. Eh. Well, I've got the continuation. Which at this point I should now be able to go say hey to my favorite little ghoulie. So let's do just that. What's my experience looking? Zero. Fantastic. You know, there was a mod I played for this game a while back. A tribute, I think, is what it was. Wasn't too bad. They definitely cranked up the difficulty across the whole game instead of just short stacking it on the uh, last little bit. It's a TV man. Heard anything? Hmm, many things. A secrets from me only. <laughs> so what's the news? Did you hear the one about the tuna and the chef? Ah, oh, I love that story. A tuna walks into a sushi restaurant and says to the chef, Hey, you killed my father. Chef says to the tuna, That's my business, fish. Tuna thinks about it says, Then I challenge you to a game of chess. If I win, you stop being a chef forever. And if I win, asks the chef, you can feed me to your customers, Tuna replies. So the chef and Tuna play chess. Tunas love to play chess, so in a few moves, the chef was checkmated. Well, looks like I win, says the Tuna. Chef nods and plunges his knife into the fish's belly. But I won, says the Tuna, as he feels the knife wiggling into his guts. So did your father, says the chef. I see, yes. 
<laughs> Good night and have a pleasant evening. You too. <laughs> hey, where'd you go? There you Master? are. Master. Oh, still nothing new. Glaze was a known hangout for one of Chinatown's largest street gangs, but it was also a popular hangout for local club kids. One witness stated that the exchange was all like, pow, pow, ah, take that, <laughs> oh, you got me, ooh, you wassily Bone rabbit, round. take that, blam, I need a sandstorm activity is thought to be responsible uh, for fucking love the ball cave, <laughs> The jets were returning from the control over the uh, when they disappeared great. off of radars. A transcript of a final radio exchange between the pilots mentioned wind conditions picking up. Uh, that box of drugs, by the way, I did finally remember where that is used. And more accurately, I should say, just looked up a guide. Turns out it is for a mission from Trip that I don't have access to anymore because I'm just way too far forwards. Oh well, such is life. In completing that mission, which is just a few dialogue checks, in turning in that item, you get uh, one experience and a bonus to your finance, if I'm remembering right. Alright, let's go to the Saucy Leopolds. Where to? Viewers beware, you're in for a scare. I wonder what the stealth kill is for the Nux. Or if there even is one. Greetings, Commander. Greetings, soldier. Anything to report? The Gladius Day has told us to keep a sharp eye. He thinks we may have some visitors this evening. Of course, sir. My duty, as always, is to protect the Brotherhood. All seems quiet for now. Good, good. Did he mention uh, what kind of visitor, sir? The oh. only kind that matters, soldier. Hey. Yes, sir. Who's there? Of course, sir. No Stay one. On. Fuck off. Mm -hmm. Who's there? No one. Fuck off. Stop right there! He did. I'm hungry. Right Motherfucker. Uh, all right. Boop. Heal. Oh. oh, that didn't go as planned. Well, at least I'm not that far back. Where to? Over to the sauce of Leopold's. Greetings, Commander. Greetings, soldier. Anything to report? The Gladius Day has told us to keep a sharp eye. He thinks we may have some visitors this evening. Huh. Okay. Uh, what kind of visitor, sir? The only kind that matters, soldier. Yes, sir. It looks like a hard one. Don't carry on. Is. No. Should I? That's good. Fuck. The name sounds familiar. How long have you been with the Conatier? Not very long. I was sworn in just last winter. I see. Oh, 
I'm just gonna go on and sneak past all the boys with very swift firing guns. Lord, I pray now that you give me strength in battle, that I might overcome the hordes of Satan and his children, that I might wield the flaming sword of the Archangel and defend myself with your shield of faith, and that my victories are many and my wounds few, that I might further your kingdom hereafter. And if I meet death tonight, then let it be first that I cast that was that so well. Oh, SOC. That's right. So now this won't activate when I cross it. Oh. Got an asshole coming this way, though. Wait for a second. Hey, bud. Turn around. Also, I'd like to get that from you. Remington. up to you. But I can get behind you here. Oh, while I'm at it, let's change to a lightweight armor. So this guy has a really nice weapon. And it's so essentially this is a fully automatic uh, rifle, uh, fully automatic version of that kind of thing. It does low damage, but it's got a lot of damage potent, uh, a lot of uh, fire rate. seems particularly uneasy this evening. Yes, LaCroix has begun to move more openly, and Brother Grunfeld grows impatient. Ah, yes, LaCroix. As always, Brother Grunfeld focuses only on his old nemesis. Let us hope his fanatic... Pause if you want to read. And with that, we'll see y'all next time.